Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel, Thrifty Mommy. So today I have a Dollar Tree haul for you guys. If you guys started on my channel from the beginning, you may have seen that I used to do Dollar Tree hauls. I did stop doing Dollar Tree hauls to continue doing coupon videos, but today I am doing a Dollar Tree haul because over on the community tab, I did post a poll for you guys, just asking you what other content you would like to see on my channel. A lot of you voted for Dollar Tree hauls or in-store hauls. So we're going to start out doing Dollar Tree hauls at least once a month just to change it up a bit and add a little bit of other content to my channel. So I'm really excited to show you what I picked up. I have a ton of like name brand items, food, all kinds of stuff. It's going to be a large Dollar Tree haul. So sit back, relax, grab yourself a drink, grab yourself a snack. And if you just happen to stop by the channel, you are new. Thank you so much for clicking on the video. Please consider subscribing and hitting that notification bell. We are almost at 3000 subscribers. So I would love to have you part of the family. So I'm gonna jump right into the Dollar Tree haul because it is a pretty large Dollar Tree haul. I'm gonna start out over at the personal care section. I found some amazing, amazing name brand items. The first one was raw sugar. Now, at first I didn't think this was a name brand item, but it kind of clicked on me. I, I think I've seen this over at Target for some reason. And of course it is, this brand is at Target. They sell for $4.99. Usually this comes in more like a bottle form. So I guess maybe they discontinued the tube and they sold it to Dollar Tree. But this is the Raw Sugar Simply Hand Wash for sensitive skin. It has green tea, cucumber, and aloe vera. I'm super bummed. I only found one in my store, but I was able to snag it. When I looked it up online, these go for $4.99. So if you're able to find it over at your store, scoop it up. This is a name brand item and such an amazing deal for $1.25. So I'm going to keep throwing down here. <laughs> the next amazing name brand item I found was from Yardley. I know you guys have seen the soaps over at Walmart, even at Dollar Tree, at Target. But I found hand soap and this is a 14 ounce bottle. It is oatmeal and almond with almond essential oil and it's a moisturizing hand soap. Super bummed as well. I only picked up one. They had quite a few bottles, but I was like, eh, I don't need. I always coupon hand wash, but I think I'm going to go pick up some more because it smells really, really good. And I can actually add these to gift baskets for the holidays. So if you find these, pick them up. Definitely a name brand item. If you never heard about Yardley, this is a great, great brand. So picked one of those up. I also picked up Placker's Flossers. So these, I have seen them, Dollar Tree, Walmart, but I was looking for the Gentle Slide. I have sensitive teeth. And you can never find these. When you find these, you have to pick them up because I think they're like a bestseller there. I was able to find two bags and I picked up both bags. So these are the ones that I picked up. They usually have the other ones. Don't mind my nails. <laughs> but um, they usually have like the green packaging, which is like the normal one. Or they have the one that's like double uh, string. But they never have or it's very rare that they have the gentle slide. So I found two bags, picked up the two bags for me. I also found over by the socks, I always like to look over the socks for myself, for my son, for my husband, see if I could find anything that is name brand. I actually found some really cute Minnie Mouse socks. I thought they were super cute. They also had like SpongeBob and they also had Ar Arnold, I think it is from um, PBS cartoons. They also had those, but I just picked these up because they were Minnie Mouse and I can use them when we head out to Disney. So I was super happy when I saw these socks there. I just had to pick them up. Another great item I picked up, I'm actually gonna save these for the holidays. It's from Brookstone, everybody knows what Brookstone is but this is the clipper and tweezer set I usually seen these being hauled 
on a lot of YouTube videos for Dollar Tree haul and I could never find them in my store until I found them finally. And they're a two pack, it comes with the clipper and the tweezers. You can definitely save these for Father's Day, for Christmas, anything. I think they make great gifts. So I picked up two, maybe to give one to my husband or maybe to give to each of my, um, to my stepdad and my father-in-law, whoever. But I thought that that was just a great item to have on hand to put in a gift basket. So I picked two of them up. They still have quite a few more. So if I do need more, I can definitely pick them up. Next, I picked this up. I actually opened it up already because I really wanted to try it out. I picked up the Sassy and Chic Eyelash Curler. I have heard so many great things about this eyelash curler and it's from Sassy and Chic. So this is a um, Dollar Tree brand, but I went ahead and grabbed it. I grabbed it in purple because that's my favorite color, <laughs> but I think it's pretty good. It's pretty soft. Like some of them are like the grip is really hard, but this one I think is pretty good. So I'm going to give it a try. Picked it up just for myself just to try it out. I know they have one from Ioni, but I picked that one up instead. Um, next, I picked up, oh, I didn't show you guys this. So I picked this up for my husband. It is the Plackers Stop Grinding Mouth Guard. So it comes with one mouth guard. You don't need to boil it. It is ready to wear. It is kind of like a slim version. My husband uses um, mouth guard, but he usually uses the one that you have to boil and kind of form it to your teeth. So I got him this to see if he wants to try it out see if it'll work for him it's one it's disposable if he wants to go ahead and use that I can get him more of these but hey it's worth a try for a dollar 25 and it's also a name brand item now I went ahead and passed by the party section always like to check to see if there's any new party items and now they have like a cake decorating section and there they have a ton of things they have stuff to decorate your cake stuff to help you decorate a cake so i picked up the cake spatula just to have it on hand whenever i'm decorating a cake i'm making a cake at home adding some frosting i can definitely use a cake spatula i think that was a pretty good deal for a dollar 25 and i also picked up the disposable icing bags this is a 12 count of bags I thought it was a pretty good deal. You can have them on hand. They do sell the tips for these if you guys are interested um, in that same section. You can definitely pick up the tips for these, but I just picked up the bags. I can use it for anything else other than just decorating with icing. I can use it for anything. So I picked that up, 12 count, not too bad for $1.25. So the next thing I picked up, we're trying to kind of vamp up the potty training game for my son um it's going pretty good he's he's getting there but i want to try something different and i want to try like a um kind of like a prize board i guess you can say so what i was thinking i grabbed this dry erase board what i'm gonna do is just look, put like potty training if he pee peed or poop and then um if he did, he can come and put a sticker. I grabbed these from the teaching tree. They are reward stickers. They have like cute little sayings on them. So what I was thinking, if he do pee pee or poopy, he can grab a sticker, put it here. And if he has like a certain amount of stickers, he'll get like a gift, a, a toy or something like that, you know, kind of change up the game make it more interesting make it more fun for him to learn to potty train so i'll let you guys know how that goes but i thought it was a pretty good idea to try something different for his potty training so that is all of like the regular section so i'm gonna go into the food items now and i got some great stuff for food um let me pick up the bags because there's two bags of stuff here and then we'll go into that. So the first thing that I found, I don't know if you guys saw a couple of videos ago, I hauled for Walmart some Kinder's seasoning. So I found Kinder's like seasoning packs for meals. These are Kinder's mains. 
the first one that i found was the fajita rice bowl and it comes with mexican rice so what i'm thinking is that it comes with the seasoning and the rice and all you have to do because it says here just add meat and toppings so i found that one and then the other one that i found was the kinder's mains street taco bowl with lime and garlic rice same thing add meat and toppings so i'm thinking it just comes with like the rice and the seasonings and then in the back it does give you the instructions i didn't show you guys that but in the back it just gives you the instructions on what to do with the packet it is uh gluten free and i think it's four servings yeah it's four servings per box so great for family meal and then the last one i found was the italian chop house meatballs you just add meat and eggs to this one so i'm thinking it comes with like the breadcrumbs and the seasoning so i picked that one up as well again it does have the instructions in the back like what items do you need and everything like that so i thought it was pretty cool i'm gonna try it out see how that works out all right i'm back i had to check on juliana because i put the music on in her little bassinet and i wanted to check to see if she fell back asleep and she did so i just had to check on her really quickly the next thing that i found these um well now that we're going into fall i was glad i was able to find these i love scooping these up whenever they have them at the dollar tree is the lipton iced tea they do have lemon and then they have the sweet tea i like to pick up the lemon just make tea at home usually these come out in the summer and then like in the fall you never see them again so i was really impressed that i was still able to find them over at my store so i picked up two bags before they kind of like disappear <laughs> for um for the um for fall but what i was thinking is since this is a unilever item you know how we get those dollar coupons or 75 cent off of one coupons um in our unilever emails maybe we can use those coupons for this and we can even get it even cheaper maybe 50 cents 25 cents haven't tried it yet but i might try to pick these up with those unilever coupons so good idea next i found these syrups so these are all the rave over at youtube um and again i was glad i was able to find them these are the kent boringer that have the chocolate and the caramel this is not a dollar tree item this is i don't know where this is from made in turkey okay so i found these great for your iced coffee you can use them on your ice cream so i picked up the caramel and the chocolate syrup i heard they were pretty good they taste pretty good i have not tried them yet so again i will let you know how it, they taste but i don't think it was bad good for coffee next see what else i have here okay i'm like on my second uh container of these this is amazing if you guys find it at your store definitely worth picking up so I use chicken bouillon in a lot of my meals. We're Hispanic, we use it in rice, in our beans, soups, um, things like that. So I was able to find this um, leaping leopard chicken bouillon, I guess powdered flavored broth powder. And this is actually my second one and I'm like halfway used. It has such great chicken flavor. They have it in chicken. They also have it in beef and vegetable flavor. I've only picked up the chicken, but it makes your food taste amazing. So if you're able to find these, I know we hauled in our couponing video, like the Noor bouillons and things like that, but this is pretty good and a little bit goes a long way. So if you guys are able to find these, let me see if you can see, it's kind of a little blurry. Um, but if you guys are able to find these, pick it up. It tastes really good. So I'm really happy with that. Sorry about the lighting, you guys. I'm kind of like by a window trying to get pretty good lighting in here. And I'm actually in Juliana's room. Um, 
so she's over in my room in the bassinet um next i found these sun vest um these are actually this one is like it's like that fiber fiber one bar from kellogg's so this is the sun best fiber boost lemon it has 90 calories this is not a name uh dollar tree item it is a name brand item but i found this one that i wanted to go ahead and try it is lemon flavor and then i also found this one is the sun best yogurt and berry biscuits this reminds me of the um belvita the belvita biscuits this one is biscuits with a mixed berry and yogurt flavored filling. I thought that tastes, I thought that sounds good or tastes good or whatever. So I'm going to try it out. Um, but yeah, I went ahead and picked those up. I want to try them out, see how they are. See if they taste pretty good or not. Next, I did pick these up. This is actually my second box. I did pick these up before, before I started doing my Dollar Tree videos again. But this is the Sun Kissed Breakfast Biscuit. This is also similar to the Belvita. You get five two packs. These taste really, really good. The other one that they have is like the cranberry orange, but I like picking up the coconut one. Has a slight coconut flavor. It's not overpowering, but I think they're pretty good, especially if you want to have them with like a glass of milk, some hot chocolate, your coffee. I think they're pretty good. And they're only 100 calories per two pack. So great little snack to have. Then, same area. And I think this is the last thing. Yep. Yep, this is the last thing. So over by the food section, actually where the coffees are, I did find these packet of coffees. So the first one I found was the Jimmy Beam you got the bourbon flavored ground coffee, which is the bourbon vanilla. That sounds so good. And then I also found just the bourbon flavored coffee in original. So I found these two from that Jimmy Bean. And then I also, now I'm from New York, I'm from Bronx, and I love Junior's cheesecake and i've been to their um like their restaurant over in manhattan and i had their coffee their coffee was amazing and now i was able to find their ground coffee over at the dollar tree here it is so it's a brooklyn blend juniors coffee and these don't expire till july I believe this one says July 2023, August 2023. And these, what you can do for like teachers, what I was thinking, if I could still find more of these, because these are for me. But if I can find more of these, what I'm going to do for like teacher appreciation day for my son's school, is basically grab one of these, grab a mug, even from the Dollar Tree, take the mug, put this in there, put a couple of biscuits or crackers and you have a really nice little gift that you can give to a teacher because usually they do themed um appreciations like every single day is a different thing bring your teacher a snack bring your teacher um something for their room or this and that so hey when they say bring your teacher a snack i can do that so i think that's an amazing idea coffee crackers a mug and that's a perfect gift so that is all that I have for my Dollar Tree haul. I really hope you guys did enjoy this video. Let me know in the comments if you enjoyed it. What did you like from the items that I picked up today? And if you want to continue seeing these Dollar Tree hauls, let me know in the comments as well. I would love to continue to film Dollar Tree hauls. It's like something different for me than doing just coupon videos all the time. Now, stay tuned towards the end of the video because I'm going to be posting a couple of other amazing items I found, some things for Halloween, other things that I found in store that you guys might be interested in picking up if you do head out to your store. As always, I want to thank you all so much for watching. Don't forget to hit that like button if you enjoyed the video. 
and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye guys.